in your last one. It should have done better. Can you say anything? No, I can't. It feels too late. Oh my God. She's been lying to me this whole time. I wasn't lying. I was encouraging. That's not true. I think Beth suffers from a, a, a crisis of confidence. It's something that's ongoing in her life. Her first book, her memoir, was medium successful. Um, I think she's not gotten health, healthy support from her uh, family growing up. So she really relies on her husband for a lot of validation. Probably she relies on him for too much validation. So I think she's very much questioning her worth as a writer. And then of course her worth as a person separate from her writing. He loves you more than life itself. What does that have to do with anything I'm here? I'm saying that he doesn't love your book, okay? He doesn't love your book. I mean, who cares? In the scheme of things, the crisis is minor. But um, in fact, it's huge to her, and um, and it's and we're speaking about <clears throat> trust and betrayal and honesty, um, and uh, these are big issues. And um, and in, there is a moment in this film where she's wondering if this marriage can survive. Um, this is how cataclysmic this event is for her. I have this incredible benefit where in this film I get to be married to an actor instead of, an, of somebody being married to me. And uh, obviously I'm an actor. And so it's this sort of fun. I kind of felt a little on my high horse about it, I'll be honest, where I'm just like watching your character go through all the <laughs> uncomfortableness and, you know, the stomach queasiness of being an actor and just being like, oh, I'm so glad I don't have to deal with that crap. <laughs> <laughs> Even though I'm acting in this movie, I'm like, Ugh, enjoy your acting life. <laughs> yeah. But um, but I do very, very much relate to Sarah's existential crisis of of I'm here, you know, the world's on fire and I'm picking out light fixtures, you know, mm. that is something that I, I love what I do. I, I, I'm not belittling. I think art is actually quite, quite important right now, but I, I think art is important. I think figuring out what I'm going to wear on a red carpet isn't. I just feel like I want to have conversations about, about, um, you know, guns and racism and misogyny and you know transphobia and all those things i'm in a play right now and and sometimes i say a line wrong and then in my brain <laughs> in the middle of the play i say well obviously everyone saw that i said this line wrong and they think i'm terrible <laughs> and now a frog and then the show and then now it's seven lines have now been said since that first thing and now I'm like, oh, I haven't even paid attention to my last seven lines. Everyone obviously realizes this. And that's why I'm the worst. So I relate to it all the time. <laughs> no, it's just a never and never ending, you know, doubt machine that goes in your brain. Oh, of, God. It's just a like, hamster wheel. A hamster wheel of just like, why should I? Yeah. Why did I? Um, it matter? Why am I getting out of bed? <laughs> I look tired. I'm, I'm aging. What are you, nuts? Well, you get Botox. Well, I just get a little bit right here. You know, I can still move my eyebrows. Watch, watch. Oh, yeah. It's so expressive. <laughs> I like the kind of mixture of what Nicole's put together, which is obviously the central issue, uh, central question uh, about honesty and how honest you can be with the people closest to you, but also about creativity and about how you get, meaningfully get the, the feedback that you need and um, how much you need that. Also about, you know, am I, um, am I my work, you know, um, uh, and then also about, you know, a marriage and about um, being in your middle age and so, I think a lot of different kind of quite relatable human themes are, are sort of woven together in a way that's both, I think, very affecting and moving, but also very, very funny and kind of sharp and insightful at the time. So, so that kind of combination of those ingredients, I think, makes for, for me a very, uh, yeah, I'm really proud of this film. I love you. Oh, okay, well, never mind. <laughs>